Hello YouTube, my name is Nero and today we have some Call of Duty Ghosts in another episode of Chem Strikes Saturday, which of course is the weekly series here on my channel where subscribers send me in Chem Strikes. This one was sent in by a guy named Levithan, who is a returning guest here on Chem Strikes Saturday. He was actually featured a lot on the show earlier on in the show's lifespan, but uh, he hasn't been on a whole lot. He hasn't been on a whole too many episodes as of late, but he's coming back with a very strong gameplay here using the Golden Maverick. We're going to be dropping a Chem Strike on the map Mutiny, and it's a pretty nice overall game. Gameplay and hopefully you guys all check that out and enjoy that but before we get into the gameplay I want to apologize for not uploading a video yesterday. It wasn't my fault. It wasn't my fault I had two videos ready to go yesterday one for near sim and one for near let's plays But the problem was both of them were over 10 minutes long and because of that YouTube was having like some kind of bug yesterday where people just couldn't upload videos that were over 10 minutes it Just wouldn't process so I did a full review of the new nemesis DLC maps Which we have two uh, nemesis chem strikes that are going up on chem strike Saturday this week uh, one on Dynamite and one on Showtime and hopefully you guys will be checking those out later on today and checking those out But I'm doing a full review of the nemesis maps and that's gonna be going up tomorrow on Sunday Which I don't usually post on Sundays. So here we go. Here we go. Let's talk about this chem strike here So we're playing blitz on the map mutiny, which is a pretty good map in my opinion I like the way it looks and I kind of like the theme of it Therefore, you know, you guys know me if it has a cool theme therefore I like the map, you know But uh, what we got going on here is he's playing a bit of blitz and he's going towards the enemy portal If you guys have ever played blitz before you guys really should know how to play if you're looking for tons of kills while playing blitz basically you go towards the enemy portal because it's over on that part of the map in that general area or vicinity that is where people are going to spawn it's the only place they're going to spawn. They're going to be all throughout there. So he's basically going up there and just taking everybody out. Uh, he could be trying to capture some points. People might argue like, oh, why is he not playing the objective? But you look at the score. His teammates are literally just blitzing through and taking all the objectives. Now we're going to be fast forwarding here because he's actually got a rather difficult task ahead of him. That task being being on a good kill streak. And then having to start over. He comes over here to the boat right away initially. So we can get some high ground and try and take out some people that way. But that can definitely be difficult, right? That can be definitely difficult to you know, be on a good kill streak. And then for the round to end, and then you're like, oh crap. Well now I gotta re-get into that good position that I was in during the previous round. It reminds me a lot of during Black Ops 2. I never usually went for like uh, nuclears or anything like that in Black Ops 2. But let's say I was going for like attack dogs or swarm or something. You know, that, you know I'm pretty close to my attack dogs. And then the round switches and domination as it does in uh, Black Ops 2. It's like, oh, now I have to get into a good position, not get killed off of my spawn. This is going to be tricky. You know, it's kind of worrisome. And he actually does it pretty well. He goes up to the boat. He takes out a couple people up there. Now he's making his way back towards the enemy portal. He's kind of aiming down towards that bar. But he does see this guy shooting from the corner. So he goes up and gets him. And now he's going to make his way moving around and try and take people out as they come out of the bar, which is one of the best spawn points on this map. You know, you're going to find a lot of the time that people like to spawn inside this bar. So they came inside here and picked off whatever people he could, which was the one person that was outside. And now he's just going to be maneuvering around as he's getting closer and closer to his come strike And that's basically the entirety of the gameplay. You know, he's playing blitz and if you're playing blitz uh, Of course always try to play the objective. I always preach that here on my channel Try to play the objective always always try to win your matches, but right now the score is 13 to 3 His team's actually gonna win really quickly So he's got to hurry up and try and get any kills he can and it's not exactly necessary for him to you know Be diving on the objective right now when his team is just completely blowing out the enemy team like they are right here But he's gonna make his way back out here and look for that one kill get Gets the chem strike off of it, which is kind of weird because it's kind of a delay as to when the chem strike itself actually popped up. But that's how we picked up the chem strike. You just playing blitz, you go towards the enemy portal, you take out some people, and hopefully not die. I guess that's the biggest part about getting chem strike, huh? Is you know not dying, not getting randomly shot from behind, not getting you know a bad spawn point or you know something like that. Uh, there's a lot of factors that go into a good chem strike into a good Call of Duty Ghost gameplay. But he ended up getting the chem strike right there. The final kill of the gameplay itself is actually going to be the chem strike, which I always think. It looks kind of cool because it's like bam he just kind of shows him walking around it's like yeah i'm the one that got the chem strike i'm the one that did it even though they won 16 to 4 which is just crazy but we go to the final score here a final score of 31 and 1 which is a fantastic overall score which is he was kind of working against his own teammates to get that chem strike as well you know because his teammates were capping the objective so fast you had your guy blair there getting seven caps and you've got the eve 13 something going for five caps you know uh, his teammates are really rushing down the objective and he was trying to keep the enemy players from stopping them to get to the objective and then up working out pretty well so i hope you guys all enjoyed this episode of chem strike saturday 
And if you did, please be sure to leave a rating. If, if you guys like said your guys' chem strikes for next week's episode of Chem Strikes Saturday, everything you guys need to see is on your screen right now. No commentary, no color correction. Try and render your video out at a very nice quality. When you do send me your videos, I download them from YouTube. And in that process, there's a little bit of quality loss from that. So the higher quality your video initially is, the less quality I'm going to lose from it. And therefore, the better quality video I could put up here for Chem Strikes Saturday. So keep that in mind. Take that high quality video, upload to YouTube as unlisted, link me a video personal message here on YouTube, and then congratulations, you have submitted your video for next week's episode of Chem Strikes Saturday. If you guys have to go ahead and check out Levithan, he's a returning guest here on Chem Strike Saturday who was featured a ton when the show kind of first came out, but not so much recently. But it's always good to see him. It's always good to see you, Levithan, and always posting up some good gameplays. If you guys want to go check out his channel, it is youtube.com slash Kajanzilla. And if you head on over there, you're going to find just under 80 videos. Most of the stuff he posts is Call of Duty Ghost related. He has tons of great gameplays, Chem Strikes, as well as he does pretty good commentary. Check him out if you guys haven't already. Chances are, if you're a fan of Chem Strike Saturday, you've probably seen some of Levithan's stuff. And he does some good stuff over on his channel so if you guys want to go check him out you guys can go do that once again that is youtube.com slash kajanzilla hope you guys all enjoyed this episode of chem strike saturday and if you did please be sure to leave a rating hope you guys all have a wonderful day